Sure, I'll give you a hand. Ancient and strategically located castle. Come on, then, you stupid bugs. that just yet. Pull up. Bronze ring, a jade belt. Guess if I was using spiders, that'd be pretty good. Not though. Welcome here, Traveller. You can always find a meal and shelter at our castle. Thanks. You're a bad person. I just saved. So if you heard the stories about the mad ghost. Gosh, for eh? Yes, it's true. I was his counselor. I was a very good one, I might add. And yes, he died, but it wasn't my fault. He was afraid of being poisoned all the time, so much so that he actually tried to accustom his body to various poisons. Thus, it's no wonder that the Baron, who was already in poor health, accidentally took too much and poisoned himself one day. What about Galena? Yes, I married his widow. Galena is a wonderful young woman, and I was secretly in love with her for a long time, but I could do nothing with Gostrom alive. I didn't even try. But after the terrible accident, my daydreams grew re into real hopes. And, uh, to my great joy, I managed to persuade her to marry me, to preserve the power of the barony and protect her lands from intervention? Ask you... Is that, uh, not just as it should be? Yeah, why didn't the Baron's son inherit the castle? I remember the youngster isn't... He doesn't even have a mustache. Look at him! What kind of Baron would he be? With those eyes... Lina's... Uh... Ah, attack! We're laying siege to a castle. It shouldn't be too hard. This is pretty light. We must have vengeance. Also, there's a knight. He is a lone knight. He still hits for 18 damage at max, but still, he's on his own.
we just sit here, then he can't reach any of us this turn, and we could swarm him next turn. Someone's gonna get hit pretty hard, though. Ow. It could have been worse. Oh, crap, I forgot. I'm gonna have to dispel that. Oh! You're not supposed to be able to reach anyone. Oh, well, uh, seven priests. Is making weird booping noises periodically. I think I left Hamachi on. Oh, I didn't need those priests anyway. Kinda wanna do this fight over just because I did that poorly. Go! Man, I lost a lot of bears there. I lost five bears. That's not cool. And you flame arrow now that he's in range. not really a threat on his own. The only units that are really dangerous on their own are big demons and dragons. As I recall, well, in the bosses. That is uncalled for behavior and just gross. smart enough to do that successfully. Stab. Twenty-three peasants killed because he's a jerk. Man, those bears are taking a beating. Peasants going down very quickly. I 
thanks for that. You know, not attacking the peasants again. He didn't want to attack them again because uh, the peasants would have, their counterattack would have killed him. Gilbert, thank you for your help. My father has been avenged, and now he can rest in peace. Thank you once again. That's why I helped your father. I'm glad that you're a completely unemotional, emotionless automaton. Something tells me that he def that de guy definitely wasn't this kid's father. Look at those glowing eyes. Oh well. I'm a hot-headed knight, I don't have time for this nonsense. Look at all that experience. Also a green banner. Priest, and definitely I'm short on swordsmen. They just can't be in any neat organized piles, they've got to be scattered all throughout the stratosphere. I know at one point in the game, swordsmen become uh, available to hire in a horde, but that's not for a while. So we still need to be a little careful with them. Magic Academy. Have I seen that anywhere? That would be no. There it is. Also, there's King's Old Castle Keeper. There's a deserted royal castle that I'm sure isn't cursed. Totally fine, don't worry about it. Welcome, Bill Gilbert. Well, well, I've heard much about your our new royal treasure searcher. And everything I've heard was good, I might add. My name is Iron Trigus. People call me Master Trigus, or Professor. Besides, my scientific magic researches in lectures, I'm also one of the chairmen of the Magic Guild of Darion, and a master of the Magic Academy. Good for you. I swing a sword. If you have any issues or questions, young man, you can always turn to me for help. Okay. Uh, always look at the store first. Inquisitors. Inquisitors. 
Dragon Slayer. I hope I won't have issue to use this for a while. I need to collect an artifact. Oh, you mean Pandora's box? But I'd rather call it the Chest of Rage. Here it is! What a beauty. It's wonderful, isn't it? A demon's creation. Can you believe uh, that we mages have spent almost a thousand years trying to solve its mystery? And even now, I'm sure that I've only managed to reveal a part of the secrets this artifact holds. But you can say uh, to his majesty that we have done the most important thing. We figured out how to tune the artifact, and even... And even what? Go on! I managed to perform a ritual and activated uh, the symbiosis component of the artifact, which means that it can attach itself to the one who closes the chain of rage. By the way, did you know that the chain of that the rage in demon in the demon's world is equivalent for mana? And there is almost no magic power there? Then it's strange. Okay. Long, long time ago in a kingdom far, far away. Uh, the purpose of the artifact? Yeah, I was speaking about the ritual that attaches the chest to its new master. The one who, by the end of the ritual, will be able to understand the, the force of the artifact and be able to talk to the spirits captured in this item. Go ahead, give it to me. You don't need to shout at me like this. Besides, you're in a physical and emotional state that is optimum for... Here, take the chest and be careful and don't let it fall. Watch out! Give me the chest! chest which the mage gave to you turned out to be pretty heavy. It slipped out of your hands. You managed to catch the artifact before it falls to the floor, but you badly hurt your hand, having struck it against a sharp edge. After the sharp pain, everything has grown dark before your eyes. You feel dizzy, disoriented. You hear some new voices. They are coming from the chest. Master! Who's there? You are new master of the chest. I... Don't understand? Blood, your blood sprinkles the stone of anger. The unity rite has been performed. It was really that simple, you just put blood on it. It's not really that complicated. Can you believe it took these guys a thousand years to figure that out? It's a chest of rage! What did you think went on it? God. The rite has been performed, but was not completed. You have completed it. You are a new master of the chest. Show yourself, will you? Weak to weak, you cannot handle this power. Uh, you're making me angry. Where are you? Hey, Bill Gilbert, are you alright? Hope your wound is not very serious. And who are you talking to? There is nobody here except us. Uh, uh... Don't you hear? There's this strange voice. It's all hissy and reptilian. Yes, voices. What do they tell you? Something sensible or just a murmuring? Uh, they're saying some kind of nonsense about blood and unfinished ritual and masters of the chest. Your blood on the chest. Feeling an intense rage. My endless droning about stuff you don't care about. You were thinking of this, of this artifact for sure, weren't you? Besides all these strange voices from nowhere, I don't even uh, know whether to congratulate you, young man, or feel sorry for you. First of all, you haven't gone out of your mind. You really are hearing those voices. And secondly, you just finished the Ritual of Unity. Now this artifact and you make one. In other words, you are the master of the chest. But I don't think you will be glad of it. I don't get it. There's nothing to get. We have been bothering over the ritual for four months, and a